video is brought to you by G2Way.com for cheap games, MSP, and PSN codes. Hey guys, how's it going? Master Bucks here, and welcome to another 2025 Career Mode video. And today, we are going to be looking at another one of the recent transfers in this window, albeit on loan to a all clubs Bournemouth. What a signing this is! It's one Manuel Turbo. Yeah, that's right, that Argentinian winger that used to have about 88 potential in FIFA at one point and used to be called the next Messi. He now plays for Bournemouth. He made his first appearance, I think, um, either a few days ago or I'm not too sure. But yeah, he's definitely already played for Bournemouth already. And yeah, that's where he's found himself right now. It's pretty crazy, but hey, at the same time, you've got to think Bournemouth. Wow, done well. A player that used to play for Roma, or should I say, still plays for Roma, now loaned away. For Bournemouth to get him, that's a hell of a coup. He's definitely still a decent player, and although he may not have the potential that he used to have, he still does have a relatively decent potential around about 83 and a 77 overall. And as you can see, his stats are still definitely very, very appealing. And we're going to take a look at them in depth right now. So here are those stats. 77 rated, one man Willa Turbo, right winger as I said, the 83 potential. The pace is there, the agility, the balance is there. Decent stamina, it's not great stamina, but either way, ball control and dribbling, his better technical attributes. He's got some decent shooting, long shots, shot power, finishing as well as that. Crossing is obviously great as well, it's not too bad. One of all his better stats. And then some okay ones here and there. He's got three side weak foot, four star skill moves, which is great. Medium attacking defensive work rate, can only play as a right winger and only about 22 years of age, so still got room to grow and time to grow. Speed and acrobat speciality, the flare trait too, of course. But let's begin this journey to 2025 with one Manuel Turbo. Let's see if he can get to not only his FIFA 16 potential, but see if he can recreate some of that old past potential that he used to have. As you can see, immediately doing not bad. He's gone up by two in the first reset in the first season, which is great to see, despite having bad form. But either way, moving on. There's no physical, no mental attribute growth, but it's all almost all technical, as you can see. Almost every technical attribute and uh, has appeared to have gone up. Ball control dribbling keeps getting better. Things like even in some of his defending, his slide tackle and stand tackle going up. It's all good to see. Moving on now to the second season with the Turbo. And after a pretty good start, a plus two, we definitely want to see that continue. And we do. It's another plus one overall increase. And again, it seems to be all technical right now, which is great to see. And you can really, really see that ball control, that dribbling especially, now in the 90s. Back with his pace as well, up in the 90s. Some stats for an 80 rated player. It's all great to see. The shot power, some of the passing's really getting honed in as well. Long shots, the shooting gets better and better. The crossing, he's really turning into a decent 80 rated uh, right winger. Now there's just the third and final season before we go all the way to 2025, before we skip ahead. And can he continue that growth? Even another plus one I'll be happy with. And that's exactly what we get. The ball control and dribbling now. And then it's like 93 dribbling for an 81 rated player now. Still no physical or mental attribute growth. I don't know about that. You definitely want to see some develop over time. But over the first three seasons, we got none. And this time around, we only see a handful of attributes get indicated to have gone up. So it's okay though. But some of the shot power, passing, all the... All the stuff that's been getting even better over the three seasons continues to get even better, and he now sits at an 81. That is two away from his FIFA 16 potential. We definitely think, I definitely think at this rate, he'll definitely hit it, but we definitely want to see this guy get a little bit better than that if it's possible. And I definitely want to see if he can hold at about 32 years of age in 2025, but the time to find that out is right now. So here we are, 2025 with Juan Manuel Turbo has the previously once thought next Lionel Messi, currently playing for Bournemouth, been able to get to a rating that resembles his potential of old. Let's take a look. What's that rating in 2025? It's an 84 overall, that's one over his in-game potential right now at 32 years of age. As you can see, nothing has gone up in this season in particular, but the 84 overall is where he sits in 2025 at the end of the 2025 season. So there you go. That's not bad at all. One over his potential at 32 years of age. He still maintained that pace, that agility, all that stuff, and the technical attributes, the ball control and dribble, and, and ball control and dribbling became so, so good up in the way up in the 90s, and then obviously some decent 80 odd rated stats that accommodate that overall. But Unfortunately, if you look at his technical attributes overall as a whole, I don't really know if that's the sort of stats that you would expect an 84 rated player to have. I don't know about you, but for me, I'm not too sure. Aside from his ball control, dribbling, and long shots, which are of course spectacular, don't get me wrong, he really doesn't seem like an 84 rated overall player, but either way, that's your decision. That's what his rating is in 2025. So that's it for a turbo, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave in the comments down below any other plays that you want for, uh, for me to do for this 2025 career mode series. And until next time, have a good one. Bye-bye.